Okay, welcome back. Uh, if you're new here, how's it going? I'm your host, Avacrack, and yeah, thanks for watching and thanks for telling a friend. So today's course, we have a request from the designer of this course to go and give it a hit. And so today, we are at Monitor Bay, Columbia, and this one is designed by Pex1986. Darcy Pex, mate. <laughs> anyway, let's get into it. Uh, what do we got? Uh, what are the settings for today? The winds are default, the fairways are normal, the greens are normal, the green speed is fast, time of day is dawn, and the weather is clear. And we will be playing it from the farthest reaches, which are the tips, uh, from the blue tees, measuring 6,788 yards. Yeah, let's get out there and go and check it out and give it a swing. It looks like a, um, another tropical course, so I thought I'd keep my dirty clothes on for this too. So, let's go. Alright, so here we are, out on the first tee, as you can see the big number one to the left of us there, I like how the um, design has done that, up on the hedge. Let's just pull the camera back, let's pull it up and see what we can see on this today's course. Very, um, very nice looking tropical course, I wish that sun was just that little bit higher though. Still very nice, oh wow, look at it down through there. Oh, the greens really stand out. It'll be easier to spot those anyway. All right, what do we get down here? Let's have a look at the little clubhouse area, or big clubhouse area, I should say. Now we got um, as a practice greens just down through here. Yep, two little practice greens. One's got the um, bunkers at the back there. Very nice. Oh, hang on a minute. We have a driving range as well. Almost missed that. Yeah, very nice. Very nice little touch. It's like a little path or something. You know, indicating it's down there, but anyway. Let's keep flying. Very nice looking course. Very nice big clubhouse here. Now, this is where I am going to add a little bit of my two cents. I would have put something along this edge to separate the, um, the sort of concrete and the um, grass, especially if you're coming into a green here. Just, I don't know, some like bit of hedge work or something like that. Probably would have looked a little uh, nicer as well. Who knows? Anyway, let's uh, pull the camera back up, and let's go down through here. Very nice, We've got this big waterfall. That looks, actually, that looks really nice in this low lighting. Very nice, and if we can just back it down through here. I think down further we've got another bit of a drop off as well. Another waterfall. Yeah, very nice. Uh, where is it? Let's uh, wander down this way quickly. Have a quick wander down by the coast. See what it looks like right down to the end. Yeah, very nice planting work. Obviously, we're going backwards here, so this will be coming back up from down there on that green. Yeah, very nice looking course. Love it. Do love a good um, a good tropical theme. Yeah, that's cool. I like the I like the rock work that this. That old Pex is chucked in here. Very nice. I like the combination of the just the little rocks on the beach as well. Oh, it's down through here as well. Yeah, I do like that. Something I haven't seen. It's it's something you don't see sort of much. You just sort of see these big rocks, and I'm I'm guilty of that. When 2K23 comes out, you'll you'll find out because that's when my course will be released. Uh, when we can port it over, but yeah, very nice looking course. There's that second drop off too, just down through there. Yeah, very nice. All right, well, I think we've pretty much seen enough. So I reckon we shall start swinging. But wow, that looks like another little nice little green down there. Hang on a minute, whoa! What is that? Right, let's go and have a look at this. All right, we'll just I'll just speed it up a little here because this could take a while. All right, so here we are. We finally made it, and I found these two lonely little trees all the way out in the ocean. I don't know how I spotted it, but kind of, kind of pretty well. It kind of stood out to me. Yeah, the court. There's a the course all the way back down through down there. Eh, two little trees. Who would have thought? All right, we're back at the first tee after that long trek out into the ocean. See those two trees. But anyway, let's get into it. Uh, what have we got? Eleven miles going with us today. Nice big par 5 starting off this course. Uh, where are we? We're playing down around here towards the ocean. 
Rightio, so let's see if we can point it out here. Shoot it over this bunker. Slight little fast. Hopefully that doesn't push all the way to the other bunkers on the other side. Gonna kick forward here. Ah, oh, we're fine. Plenty of fair way to play with. Yeah, but wow. Nice looking course. Very nice. Alright, 194. 32 down. Again, we got that win. We're going to probably have to use some of this break over here, maybe. See if we can bring it, bring it round. Oh, what did I do there? All right, four iron. Six. Probably coming with a seven, maybe? Seven bit of low loft. We have that wind. Oh, that wind's bringing it right around real quick, isn't it? Oh, it's going to be short. Give me a lucky bounce. Oh, we did get the lucky bounce onto the green. He's going to catch a little bit of that break, but I think it's going all the way off to the back here. And we will be chipping back on, I do believe. A little lob west chip. Oh, we got slightly uphill. Just so slightly, I think that's sand wedge. Yeah, sand wedge chip. We might hit that one a little hard. Alright, let's pop this one in. What have we got? Birdie time. Come on, baby. Nice little putt. Let's put a bird on the scorecard for this first hole. Alright, there it is. Let's keep going. Hole 2 is just in front of us as well. Alright, what have we got? Nice little par 3. Beautiful view of the waterfall there. Or the first waterfall section. Um... What's it doing leading up into this? Alright, we got 12 miles coming at us on this one. That could be a 4 iron. The wind has pushed that right. I'm, oh, okay, I've overheated it a little bit. There is a bit of a break. Might come back a little bit here. Not too much though. It's a nice close-up of the waterfall, which is beautifully done. And another gorgeous shot out of the oceans. Yeah, got some very nice, um, very nice views on this course. All right, what do we got? Fifteen feet, five inches down. One seventy-four green speed. Nasty bit of a break. Taking a bit of power out of this one. Well, I think it's going to turn a bit too too hard. Oh, it did too. It just scraped the edge, though. Just missed. I think the lighting... See, this angle's fine. I, I feel like the lighting could be a lit, just a little bit higher, maybe. I think it's going to be quite dark in some areas. That's all right. You can always change it, though. This is just what the um what its default setting is. All right, what have we got? Hole three, par four, 340, 35 up. I'm not really sure why we have all this. I guess you could play short. But with this fairway the way it is, I think I'm just going to smash it straight up here. Looks like a bit of a nice angle coming into the green there. So we're going to crack up there. And yeah, I don't know. I don't know if there's any real point to the um other bit of the fairway down there. Maybe it gives you a better option coming into the green. Uh, who knows? All right, what do we got here? 65 yards. We've got the lob edge pitch in the hand. Actually, that might not be too bad. We can probably get this to slow down a little bit. Let's have that downhill slope on the green. 10 mile winds. Nasty slope we're on as well. Put some backspin on this, see what we can do. Yeah, so it's a little dark in some areas, but the cloud, I think, has just got in front of the tree. Oh, get down that hill. My God, that just stopped on a dime. I thought, if that's... Oh, shit, look at this. Wasn't a bad shot. Again, beautiful view off the green. All right. 
right, moving on. What are we up to? Hole four. What have we got? A par four? Um, yeah, so it's probably going to look a little dark to you on, um, when I post this video. It kind of gives it that cool look, though, doesn't it? It's like, you know, like you got the sun down the distance and, yeah, different. Anyway. Oh, shit. What can we do here? That's tempting, isn't it? That is very tempting. Can I smash it and land all the way down there, get the wind to bring it back around for me? God, I hope I don't get a slow. Oh, no, we got a fast instead. That is through the palm. That is going to drop down very quick. But we did make the fairway. Didn't end up in the jungle, which is a bonus. I uh, would have needed a machete to get out of there. All right, what do we got? 100 yards on the 9-iron pitch. We do have that wind against us. And a nasty lie again. Oh, this doesn't look like a bad shot, distance-wise. Oh, spot fucking on. Nice little bird. Come on. There it is. Yeah, baby. All right, currently three under at the moment. Not a bad scoring course so far. Uh, what have we got? Hole five, par four, 302, four down, and 12 pushing us out. To the right. Oh, drivable par four. Okay, we're gonna have to put some low loft on this. We're coming in hot. Plain and simple. Could play short. Could um yeah. Play short up here, something like that. No, nah, we're going for it. Alright, low loft. A lot of wind. Bit of a partial. This usually ends bad when I'm trying to do a partial driver. Oh, what are we getting? Oh, 98%. A little bit of low, low. Oh, shit, we're too low. Too low, too low. Okay, playing from the bunker. <laughs> that quite did. It didn't work out like I, I had planned. Obviously. All right, 90. Yep, that looks about right. Bad little shot out of the bunker. Hopefully I can put this one away for another little bird. Oh, it's got a bit of a break to it. It's moving quite quickly. Get it a little firmer. Take a bit of that break out of it. All right, moving on. Hole six. Looks like a nice little hole in one chance. Par three. Oh, very nice looking little hole. Alright, what are we got? 11 miles going with us. Oh, 8 iron pitch. Drop it down to the 9 iron pitch. Or do we take a sand wedge normal? Bit of high loft on it. Bit of backspin. Oh no, not a slow. Oh shit. Please don't be short. Alright, chip in. This could actually be a chip in. Oh yeah, there it is. There it is. They even ripped the massive red fast in it too. But yeah, the next game, eh? The chips, I've heard they're going to be a little bit difficulter. Or more difficult. So, could be interesting. Probably won't be sinking as many as, um, as what I do on here. It's quite easy, actually. 21 it was a um, big step from um, uh, 2019, like TGC 2019. All right, uh, what do we got? Hybrid in the hand. Nah, wind's going with us. We're fucking driving it eight miles. Oh, can I, can I scrape over there? Might be able to get a lucky bounce on a rock. Oh, this is dangerous. Shit. Here we go. Oh, crushed it. 
Oh, we're on. We're on. Easy, easy done. All right, 43 yards. That's a lobbage. Let's change that to a flop, eh? Nice little lobbage flop. Bit of backspin. The high loft. Oh, I said those back to front as I did that then. Oh, wow. Absolutely ripped into that. At first, I, when I was flying around, I, w I wasn't overly keen on the green colour. I thought it was a little bright, but it's kind of growing on me now. It is. Definitely kind of growing on me. Alright, another nice little chip in. It's easier than putting, isn't it? Alright, we'll skip that replay. Let's keep moving. There's those two trees right down the background. Alright, let's... Uh, what are we up to? Hole 8, par 4. Nice. 478. 52 feet up. And it looks like a cloud has gone in front of the sun again. I oh, crushed it. That one's gone. Uh, 148 30 up yeah just a little bit of a hedge or something around that concrete would have been nice uh what are we at 184 30 yard bit of wind i don't know if it requires the three iron probably should though Well, this is looking pretty good. Going to be a little long. Going to roll out just a little bit, but uh, it's not. It's not bad there. A right, slight little downhill part. What is it? Two inches down. A little twelve footer. I'll come back around. Come back around. <laughs> Oh no, this didn't break as much as what I thought it was going to. Well, and that broke heaps. All right, moving on, last of the front. All right, big par five to finish it, nice. Uh, what are we got, 582, 19 feet down. 11 miles going with us. Do we shoot it up this side? I say we do. Oh, that's a fast, that's definitely not in the bunker. Could be in the rough. A little lucky bounce. Thank you. And well, that should leave us a nice shot into the green. Kind of hoping. Oh, yeah, we got 10 miles going with us. Oh, wow. The hybrid could be um, a little bit much for this. Could be overshooting it and into the bunker off to the um, left there. Three iron. Oh, I don't think it's going to get there. Let's go hybrid, put some lay loft on it. Oh, slide a little fast. That's going out towards the bunker too. Oh, it's going to hit that green. Scoot across it. And pull up on the fairway. Nicely done. All right, another little chip. Let's see how we go with this one. Oh, which chip? Let's increase that because it's uphill. Oh, God, that was close. A little bit too much carry on that one. All right, well, that's the front number. Was it seven under after that? Only got two pars. 
All right, hole 10, par 4. 3, 69, 28 down and 15 coming at us. All right, let's just, um, seeing the wind's coming at us, we'll just smash it straight down here, I think. I'm going to try and take any shortcuts. Because we wouldn't have made it. All right, would we get out of that 282? Not too bad, considering we had, what, 15 miles coming at us. I right, want 30 down. I mean, sorry, 130 down. 130 to go. 16 down. Little pitching wedge. I think we'll take the gap wedge. Gap wedge normal. Pretty windy. I start lie. We're aiming way out here. Actually. Yeah, take the gap wedge. Put some high loft on it. Backspin, all the good shit. Oh, actually, didn't need any backspin on that. If anything, I needed a bit of low loft just to get it there. That's left me with one nasty putt. Again, gorgeous view, but nasty ass putt. Oh, that's downhill five inches down. 34 footer. Right to left break, and it is breaking. Um, out there looks all right. What's it feel like? Yeah, okay, I might, I might have to come out a little bit more, actually. All right, here we go. Oh, that, that was a bad putt line. Bad swing tempo. Well, it needed to come out even more. All right, moving on. Uh, what are we on? Hole 11. Uh, four. All right, 444. 42 up. Ooh, 11 miles going with us. Yes, please. We can nail this fairway, surely. Oh, smashed it. Rode that wind all the way up there. 330 yards. Okay, the wind's still going with us. We got 126, 17 up. Bit hard to see the uh, pin from back here. But it blends in with all the tree trunks and stuff. Oh, I was going to say that was slow. Almost was, though. <gasps> that needs to sit down. Oh, one little bead. Breaking. Is that down? It is two inches down. How much is that going to turn me? Just enough. That's how much. All right, let's keep going. Eight under. We're going for, we're going for double digits here. And here we have the hole 12, par 3. Darkest hole on the course. Actually, it looks, it looks quite nice, actually. He's standing up here in the shadows and he got all the sun down there on the green. Uh, 166, 22 down, 14 mile winds, 22 down, 14 mile winds. That is windy. Oh, look at the wind, bring that back around. Oh, keep rolling, keep rolling, catch the slope, catch that slope, there we go. That's my ball. Oh, nice little straight part, is it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Number one. In my own imaginary world. Alright, uh, hole 13, par 4. That's a beautiful shot. Beautiful um, view anyway. 
Uh, what have we got? 286, 28 down. 11 miles going with us. That's definitely not a driver. Aim at the tree, hopefully miss it. Oh, yep, we'll definitely be missing that tree with the, um, that big, big fast. Didn't miss that bunker, though. Mac bam straight in it. Uh, pitching wedge splash. Actually, let's flop it. That looks pretty good. Oh, that, that little bit of a hill slowed me down beautifully then too. Gus caught the top of it. Just enough to slow the bounce down. There's those two little trees. Um, okay. So I don't know if the, um, the draw distance or the view distance is probably quite as much on a, maybe a console. I'm, I, I think uh, Pex designed this on console, so... Yeah, maybe it didn't show up. That's probably why it was missed. Maybe it's like, I don't know, an Easter egg or something. Oh, who knows? Anyway, let's keep going. 176, 13 down, 13 coming at us. All right, that's definitely like a five, I believe, especially into this wind. Oh man, my perfect is like just right on being a slow. Oh, definitely need more, probably a four. And, oh, that's a nasty slope behind the hole. That is a very nasty slope. Not looking forward to this putt. We got a break. Oh, might break a little hard here. The two just stop there. All right, let's go. What do we got? Hole 15. Oh, it's a par five. Currently sitting at 10 under. All right, 5.12. Uh, what do we got? Eight feet down, 10 miles coming at us. This is a nice big long par five, isn't it? Oh, shit. Hopefully that's fairway. Don't go on the rough. Don't go on the rough. All right. That's not, not too bad. I only got 269 out of that, but it was into the wind. And I did fuck up that tee shot, so... Uh, what about 244? Ooh. The wind. That's way too much. Bring in with the hybrid. Oh, now I've gone the other way. Gonna kick back onto the fairway. And leave me with a nice little it'll give me a pitch, but I think I'll flop it. Yep, that's definitely it. Yep, that's a flop. Gonna flop it onto the green. And stop. Come on. Oh, in the shade. Nice. All right. There it is. Hell yes. That is another birdie. All right. 11 under. We've still got three holes to go. Now, he did say that this was uh, one of his easier courses. I'm pretty sure. And, um, yeah, he's third design. Did I mention that at the start? I can't remember if I did, but, yeah. He's third, third design. Yeah, not bad at all. Okay, we're not getting up there with driver. There's no way. I don't think there's any other options to go for off the tee.
Alrighty, 109, 17 up, 10 coming at us. That is not an 8 iron pitch. Probably like a 7. Kind of hoping. Nasty ass lie again. That's, it's, been, it's been hard with those these lies. Hoping that wind holds that up, just like it did. Oh, came down like a fucking dart. Look at the divot it made. Hey, Lobwood's chip. Is it? Is it? Yes, it is. There it is. It's gone. All right, hole 17, second last of the day. Once we um get past this replay. Um. All right. So, what do we got? Hole 17, par four. Very nice looking hole. Again. Uh, 437, 8 up. It gets a bit narrow up here. Oh, that sounded crisp, and it was too. That's it. Give me a nice semi flat spot. Doesn't look too flat. Nope, look at that. <laughs> look at all that red. It's a nice little green light just overlooking down there, the rest of the course, isn't it? Uh, 171, eight down. Wind. Is that, it's all sloping down with an eight iron. I don't think an eight iron's gonna roll enough. Oh, uh, actually, we might be able to get this eight to roll, maybe. We had some low loft and look how far I'm aiming out here. Really because of the lie in the wind. I'm going to aim right at that tree. Uh, yeah, no, I was, was going to say that could be a little bit excessive, but I don't think it will be actually. I think I'll need to go further. This needs to roll. Oh, is it going to scrape past the fringe? No, we're on it. We're chipping. That's a couple of little breaks just in front of the cup there. Slightly downhill, so I'll take a bit out of that and add a bit of backspin. Oh, that was fast. That's not coming back around. <laughs> as soon as I swung at that, I was like, nah, that's way too fast. Now slow that shit down, man. Alright, here we go. 18th hole. Bring it at home. Can we make it 13? Actually, it is a par 5. So this... We could be playing for an eagle here, hopefully. With the wind. Oh, I've got to try and thread the needle through these bunkers, don't we? The wind, if that rolls down, it's probably going to push me to that one. So I'm going to try and right, aim for the middle. Break down the middle of those two bunkers there. That's my plan. Caught the perfect. Uh oh, that wind did not bring it around enough. No, nope, we're going. Oh, hang on. No, nope, no. Nope. Shit. We're in the rough. Damn it. And that is going to stuff me up for that next shot coming in. There's no way we're going to make it. Five iron. Yep, yeah, no, nah, that's just stupid. That's just fucking ludicrous. Not doing that. I have my limits. Hey, just watch out for that rock there. You might trip going onto that bridge too, alright? Not really um cart friendly that one. Um, all right. Don't stub your toe on it either. You might end up over the side. All right, let's just four iron. And uh, we'll be on in three, hopefully, unless I smash it over or. Do something stupid or fall and fall way short. Got the pitching wedge pitch. Get wedge pitch. 
a little bit of wind, slightly downhill. Oh, hang on, what am I doing? What am I doing? What are you doing? Okay, yep, gap was pitched. There we go. Oh, that was way fast. <laughs> yep, ripped into that one. Should sit down for me, though. And hopefully we'll pick up a nice little bird on this and take it to 13 under. Nice little putt, though, for a birdie. Better see that break with going between my legs. Oh, and it's it. There it is. 13. Oh, what a round. What a round. No bogeys, no water. <laughs> Can't believe it. All right, not a bad course at all. So yeah, again, that was um, Monitor Bay, Columbia, and that was designed by X. 1984, was it? Oh, sorry, I don't have much of a screen up. <laughs> sorry, but I know it was Pex. I remember that. Pex. <laughs> anyway, I'm done for another day. If you like this, by all means, you can smash that thumbs up, smash that subscribe, and hell, it's easy, it's free. Yeah, and you can tell a friend too. Anyway, I'm out of here. Until next time, stay safe and yeah, keep it out of the thick shit, eh? Later.